Frankie's having a stare down with the red squirrel over there. <laughs> I wonder who's going to make the first move. <laughs> oh, that's a standoff. Oh, Frankie's getting dozy. The squirrel's going to wait until he shuts his eyes and then he's going to make a run for it. <laughs> Well, I was making really good progress with the stone wall, but I'm getting slim pickings with my stone selection. So, I've been out on a rock quest. <laughs> you gotta have the puzzle pieces to make the puzzle, don't you know? <laughs> the more rocks I have, the easier it is to build because, <sighs> it's like I said, it's like building a puzzle. But I found a few today. Now I'm using the quad to bring them back to the camp. Yeah. Seems like just finding the stones is the hardest part about building the darn thing. That's a good one. Got a nice face on that side. Not bad on that side too. That's a dandy right there. Flat top and bottom, nice face on it. Yeah. I don't really know why I enjoy this so much, but I always have. Every place I ever lived, since I've been an adult, I built stone walls. I work my butt off, but I love it. Standing back later on through the years, looking at it, I just love it. And I kind of wonder if I'm just an old soul that was kicking around these mountains back in the 1700s, building all these old stone foundations, because I'm fascinated with them. It's like to build stuff that's going to last beyond my years. And someone will go, oh, I wonder who built that. I got a red squirrel right here watching me. Another supervisor. What are you doing? How do you like it? Doing a good job? Yeah, talking to you. <laughs> here comes some junk on this All right, let's see if this fits follows that contour pretty decent. That'll work. Just got to get it shored up. Well, it looks like we made out pretty good with our firewood. Remember this stack? I'll show you. Used a little bit off of the top of these two stacks. Just a few. But I still got all of this left. So if you picked up all of this here and put it on the top of those two stacks, it would show that I have two full stacks and we only burned four stacks, four rows. That's pretty good. Yeah, so we're in good shape for the winter already. I have all of the winter wood already cut. I put a bunch over there that was green. I was in uh, the early fall, I guess I stacked that up. So that's going to be good and dry. It's going to be great. So we used, it looks like about 60% of 
of our firewood. And you saw the winters up here, man, they're brutal. <laughs> but we were nice and warm, cabin stays really nice. That kitchen queen does a great job, keeps the fire all night long. We sleep with a sheet all winter long. This time of year, we use a blanket because the fire's not going, so it's a little cool in there in the morning. It's kind of funny that it's much warmer in the camp in the winter than it is in the summer. Yeah, so anyway, we've done well. That's good. I was kicking around on the woods, the property that I bought last year. There was a camp over there when I was a kid. It was a bunch of stuff that was discarded out in the back 40. Stuff that's been there since I was a little boy or before my time. So I found this old wash tub. <laughs> they don't make them like this anymore, I'll tell you. This thing's heavy duty. Been out there all these years. Little bit of rust on the bottom, but I'll probably blow a few more holes into the bottom here. And Mama wants to plant some herbs in it. Nice little herb garden. And I found this old gas tank. This thing's pretty hefty. It's been out there for a long time, probably since the 40s or 50s, right? <laughs> I'm gonna make something out of this. Now, some of you know how I think. So, take a guess. Let's see who guesses what I'm gonna do with it, okay? <laughs> I wonder if any of you will guess what I'm gonna make out of this old tank. <laughs> So if you want to take a guess at what I'm going to make out of it, put your guess in the comment section down below. <laughs> oh, I've been laughing. So I'm sitting here this morning drinking my coffee and I was looking, uh, looking for some reviews on bug repellents. And I come across all these videos about bugging out. It must be the trend. There's a video about this guy's bug out bag and another guy building a bug out box. <laughs> and I saw a bug out shelter and even a bug out trailer. <laughs> and I, I just can't help but wonder where the hell everyone's buggering off to. <laughs> There's this big bugging off going on. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Frankie? You want to bugger off? <laughs> Frankie and the boss out walking in the woods, living life happy and free. Tracks in the snow everywhere they go, there's a pokey way up in that tree. A beaver built a pond where they have some fun Taking life a day at a time Best friends until the end Frankie and the boss Frankie and the boss Frankie and the boss